The referee today is uh, Ryan Atkin. Let's wait and see exactly who is going to get uh, kickoff. Manakai Boateng is the Palace player. It's going to be West Brom to get us on the way then. Was against Everton. Everton. Yeah. And here is uh, Alfie Matthews. Oh, he's gone for goal. He's hit the cross pot. Seven minutes into his Crystal Palace Ooh. debut. Almost marked it with an outrageous strike. And shape it in. It's too easy. And here is Windsor. Quick centre forward. Dice again is on the move. The left wing back. Oh, Whoever God. thought about coming. Dice. That's a really good ball. It's a very good goal. Finn Thorndike with the finish. And West Brom hit the front after 12 minutes at Selhurst Park. Turn, turn. Yeah, he's done well. Go on, Here is Benteke. Banks is doing his best to make up some ground. Benteke's done superbly. He's rolled it through to Banks. Great chance. Oh, Scott. Not taken. Looked offside. Excellent play from Christian. And here is Alfie Matthews. Mm, Banks is on here. And Banks has made that run. It's a sumptuous ball. Perfect from the debutant. Hit Banks it. beats his man as well and hits the post. Lovely. Well, how unlucky is that? That would have been a fantastic Crystal Palace goal. It's Toby King. What a strike. Goodness me, that one flew. Side of the pitch, a posse of players around the penalty spot. Oh, and it's Benteke's header. Oh. And either side of the keeper, and it would have yes. surely been 1 1. Kirby reverse pass to Matthews. Picked out Sam Woods. Yeah. Woods back towards Matthews. It's a very long 1 2. Oh, and goal. Banks scores brilliantly. Crystal Palace's first goal at this level as a Category 1 Academy is scored by Scott Banks, and it was a beauty. Drilled, far post. Alfie gets up, heads it back. Scott on the swivel. And we were right behind that. It was a really good strike. Low, keepers left. And it's Woods. Oh. That is a good ball. And Benteke with a, an unorthodox header Very. almost scores. They've worked this very nicely. Dangerous situation. Windsor is in. Oh. And West Brom hit the front again. Less than four minutes into the second half. A well worked goal. And Owen Windsor puts the baggies 2 1 up. Now David Boateng. Oh, go on, David. Oh, hit it firm. Banks. It's a great ball in. It's going to come through to Sam Woods here. Ooh, Woods. Well, he caught hold of that one beautifully. <laughs> the centre back playing right back today, and he almost scored. So. Good ball into Flanagan in space. It's where he wants the ball. Get beyond his man. Has he managed to find Gordon here? Oh. And the referee points to the spot. Penalty kick. Palace might have put that in. Bank scores beautifully. And he's having quite the afternoon in the Selhurst Park sunshine. It is 2-2. Always, always a good one if you send the goalkeeper the wrong way, but it was firm, it was low, and um, importantly, it's gone to the back of the net, so... Pass it, pass it, too many touches. And eventually he's dispossessed by Dice. Ollie Weber was out of position there, the goalkeeper wins up. Oh dear. Oh, you expected him to score. Kirby short to uh, David Boateng, now Malachi Boateng. Go on, Here dive. is Banks. From left back. Here we go. Flanagan. This Hit might it. happen with him on the ball. Yes. They have. Kean Flanagan. And on a big day for the academy, Flanagan might just have won this game against West Brom. A fifth goal. And is it three points for the Eagles? Well, excellent from start to finish. From the throwing, from the throw-in over the over this near side, the quick play out to the other side and this is what happens when people get tied you use your substitutes you get somebody who's a bit more a bit more fresh and drive at that defense 
come inside, opens up. I think it's through the legs and into the back of the net. It is only three minutes. Here comes that long throw, though. Palace need to defend this, need to see it out. It's careful, bobbling around on the edge of careful. the box. No. And the shot is in. And West Brom have equalised. There is another twist. And having scored moments ago, Crystal Palace hearts are broken here. It's 3-3. Go on, JK. Here's Gordon. Gordon's in. What an extraordinary end. Gordon! Not quite. Well, that would have been unbelievable had Palace retaken the lead.